look at, I don't know, the difference between, you know, coaching professionals and coaching kids, right. or, and, or, or do you want them to be more like professionals, or, or do you embrace the, the fact that they're growing? Well, I think it's a unique balance you need to have. There, there are a lot more uh, things emotionally that I don't, well, I'm still learning, but I would assume that they're not prepared for um, here in college. But they're big kids in, in the pros too, and they all have similar, you know, issues and, and problems and the same, you know, transition issues, or they can't find a ball a certain way, et cetera, et cetera. You have to coach your butt off in that regard. Um, the, the biggest difference is your, your time. Um, it's all football, you know, obviously in the pros, and there's a lot of other factors that will pull you towards. You know, having to speak to parents or, you know, pressuring the, the, the guys to study hall in class and things of that nature. Uh, the rules, you know, are, are a lot. I'm um, still working my way through both of the rule books, so uh, that's, that's different for me, you know, uh, clearly. And then the relationship part of it is going to be big for me. I, I, I don't, you know, know many or any high school coaches on a personal level outside of the people that I grew up around in, in Louisiana. So uh, that's going to be unique for me to get on the road and develop relationships so we can try to acquire the best talent as possible. Big real books? There are two, both of the books, no, no joke, man, yeah. no joke. And it's uh, all of the bylaws and all of that stuff, yeah. man, it's, it's a head scratcher sometimes. It's uh, yeah. It's interesting and trying to work through that and then the details of the playbook and the recruiting and yeah. you know it's just it's a little different. I'm, yeah. I'm working my way through it. You know, haven't been on a job now for what all the three and a half weeks. Yeah, yeah so it's a unique challenge. Similar to that though, you're you're from this area. You've been around this area before. Mm -hmm. How much do you think that will help you as you do kind of adjust yeah. to a new situation? I hope it's a it's a huge part of the equation, and you know, yeah. it, it, it leads to some success in a lot of areas. Um, being fortunate enough to play in the SEC, you know, growing up uh, pretty close here in Louisiana. Um, I'm hoping that there are some people that still remember who I am that will call their usher those relationships a little bit faster. And, uh, you know, I can earn their trust and, you know, earn some of the kids' trust and, and uh, see if we can work our butts off to get them here. Speaking of who you are, mm -hmm. after all those classic battles back in the 90s uh, with Auburn and Florida, mm -hmm. how weird is it to wear the Auburn colors now? Well, I, I think it's awesome for me. Um, and it's a unique opportunity. Um, we're at the top of the food chain. You know, this is the SEC, and um, to, to have this opportunity here with these, you know, group of young men that, that, that kind of have a, a narrative that we have to change. I'm, I'm hoping to be a, a positive contributor to that. But uh, it's all War Eagle, you know, and, and um, we're going to go from there. Have you shown your? Have you shown any of the receivers any of your highlights? You know what? My first text message came yesterday uh, from Chick. And uh, I'm sorry. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, Mr. Dawson, as I have to call him here. Uh, <laughs> but he actually texted me yesterday, and he said that I had no idea that the Sugar Bowl was like that. Yeah. So, uh, I don't push that narrative, you know, in, in terms of talking about myself and showing myself. I do share experiences. Uh, you know, both positive and negatively, you know, when it, in regards to myself. And I share a lot of uh, stories and situations from uh, obviously my days coaching in the pros because there's similar, uh, I guess, characteristics in some of the kids here that I've uh, coached over the past few years.